Hello and welcome to this edition of the AMC News Dispatch. I'm Diana Dawa from the Office of Public and Congressional Affairs. The U.S. Army Top Ten Inventions for calendar year 2007 were honored at a ceremony held in Crystal City, Virginia, June 12. The annual Army-wide awards program is dedicated to recognizing the U.S. Army laboratory community's best technologies with military application and utility. Nominations for the program were submitted from across the Army laboratory community. This news dispatch highlights the AGI awards ceremony and the 2007 winners. Welcome to the awards luncheon and ceremony of the 2007 Army's Greatest Inventions. The Secretary of the Army, the Honorable Pete Guerin, and General Benjamin Griffin, Commander, U.S. Army Materiel Command, recognized and awarded the teams representing the Army's top ten greatest inventions for calendar year 2007. Just think about the things that in the past that have been recognized in this forum that they were putting out there, that you're putting out there, uh, to help soldiers and It's just a tremendous accomplishment. The 2007 winners are... Damage Control Resuscitation of Severely Injured Soldiers was selected from the U.S. Army Institute of Surgical Research. The Unmanned Aircraft System Shadow 200 Communications Relay System and the Reconnaissance Vehicle System are winners from the U.S. Army Aviation and Missile Research Development and Engineering Center. The Objective Gunner Protection Kit, the XM982 Excalibur Precision Guided Extended Range Artillery Projectile, the Picatinny Blast Shield for Light Armored Vehicle, and the M110 7.62 millimeter semi-automatic sniper system are winners from the U.S. Army Armament Research Development and Engineering Center. This is a tool that basically enhances the capability of the warfighter and gives him capabilities that he did not have before and they're, they're very excited about it. The self-protective adaptive roller kit and the Humvee egress assistance trainer were selected from the U.S. Army Tank Automotive Research Development and Engineering Center. Well, they threaten in both theaters in the CENTCOM AOR, Afghanistan and Iraq have a significant pressure command wire IED threat. So the roller, the spark, is, a, is one way to mitigate and reduce the threat to save soldiers' lives. The Humvee Egress Assistance Trainer gives soldiers the opportunity to experience a realistic rollover training event prior to deployment. And it's been recognized now as a pre-deployment requirement to go through heat training before any soldier sets foot on theater, in theater right now. So the, the importance of getting that training experience, confidence in your equipment, has paid off big dividends in terms of overall safety and use of uh, uh, military vehicles and combat operations and uh, has reduced the number of accidents and we, we feel a general trend in reduction of fatalities in a rollover event. Well, the reason why a lot of us got into this business is to save soldiers lives and even if somebody just tells you one time you save one life it makes it all worth, worth going to work every day. The Improvised Explosive Device Interrogation Arm was selected from the U.S. Army Communications Electronics Research Development and Engineering Center. The Army's Greatest Inventions Program greatly enhances communications between the warfighter and the research and development communities and satisfies the Army goal of transitioning enhanced capabilities quickly. Army soldiers from active duty divisions and the Training and Doctrine Command evaluated the nominations, reflecting the voice of the warfighter and providing soldier insight into the future of Army equipment. The ten winning programs were selected based upon their impact on Army capabilities from the warfighter's perspective, making the AGI awards truly the Soldier's Choice Awards. That wraps up this week's AMC News Dispatch. If you would like more information on the Army's Greatest Inventions Program, or other AMC news stories, visit our website at www.amc.army.mil. Thanks for watching.